Welcome to Toy and Robert, your agony aunts. Deeply unqualified, willing and unable to give you proper answers to all your burning questions. Now, Stu, you say you've got a nest of ghosts in your cuckoo clock. Very dangerous. They eat all your Q-tips, yet alone eating the cuckoo. So I suggest to get rid of them that you play Bolero back to back for 24 hours until they move next door. Beck Wolf, I sometimes find my work commitments mean I cannot catch up with Toya on social media. And he means YouTube and Facebook official. What can he do about it? You're suffering, dude. I suggest you get yourself in two places at once. I suggest so your mobile phone into your underpants and stare at your crutch all day. Perhaps no one will notice when you're at work. David Bentley, where do I train to qualify as an unqualified Agony uncle. Don't know. I'd sign on to the bad school of social sciences. David Bentley also asked, would it help if I bought a guitar? It's unfair for you to have two questions when everyone else has one, so I'm not answering. Never asked Robert two questions in one breath. You've seen what he's done to journalists when he does that. Angela Turner, where do you get your lovely dresses from? I get them for Christmas and my birthdays, thanks to L.K. Bennett and Misguided. Martin Arnold, how can I get Robert to say bollocks for his ringtone? Okay, you're going to do four bollocks, Robert, in isolation, different emotions, one happy, one angry, one sad, one normal. There you go, this is for Martin. There you go, Martin, for your ringtone. Typical man, do you have any secrets how you lovely folks live your life without worry with all the news going on in the world at the moment? Okay, I'm going to tell you this exercise because this has saved my life because I think we, like all of you, have been terrified in the last six months and you don't know what to do, you feel powerless. This is a very basic exercise. When fears start rising, you say and feel the following within yourself. I understand why you're here, but fear doesn't help me. It only hurts me. It only makes things harder for me. Feel this truly within. And then within time, you get what's called balance rather than pendulum swinging. So you recognise that fear is a thought controlling you. And sometimes you just need a weekend away from the newspapers, away from the telephone and away from the news. But you do want to watch Agony Aunts and Toya at home. So thank you very much for that, typical man. Now, oh, this is world not world. I have a question. How do I submit it? Uh, the same way you ask this one. <laughs> I think that's brilliant. Um, this is from Michael. My wonderful wife came to America from China 21 years ago. I've taken her to see King Crimson many times. She likes the music, but she doesn't understand it. What can M Michael do to help his wife? I don't understand it either. Okay. I don't understand it either. So, hello from Hungary, from Quaz. I have a question, please. Toya, be honest. Did you like King Crimson before you met Robert? I own the album Discipline. I've now been married for 34 years. Do I still like King Crimson? Next question. <laughs> this is me, me, me. Please show us, this is Ruben Drake, how to dance in 5-4 again. Oh yeah, come on, hot foot for it. Okay, I'm getting warmed up, warmed up, okay. So let's put one on a jump. One, two, three, four, five. 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 Uh, lovely. You're, you're counting in five, but dancing in six. Oh, <laughs> aren't I brilliant? That's clever. One, two, three, four, five. One. Two, three, four, five. Six. One, two. Okay. Kindly observe. One, two, three, four, five. 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 <laughs> so for our last 
last question today. We have been asked by one of Robert's dedicated followers how in the court of the Crimson King would work if in the new standard, standard tuning. tuning. All right, so this is the one. Are you going to start in the new standard tuning? No, I'll begin in the conventional. So, two, three, four. The rusted chains of prison moons are shattered by the sun. I walk a road, horizons change, the tournament's begun. The purple piper plays his tune. The choir softly sing Three lullabies in an ancient tongue For the court of the Crimson King I apologise for my feeble accompaniment, dear, but talk among yourselves and I'll just put on another guitar. So that was the old standard tuning? Yes, that was the original E-A-D-G-B-E tuning. Come and say that on camera. Yes. That was the original E-A-D-G-B-E tuning, and this is now the new standard C pentatonic tuning. So, if my wife, here's your key, lovey, um, what would it be, yeah? The rusty chain. Good, so I will play it now in the new standard tuning. Two, three, four. The rusty chains of prison moons are shattered by the sun. I walk a road, horizons change, the tournament's begun. The purple piper plays his tune, the choir softly sing. Three lullabies in an ancient tongue, from the court of the Crimson King. <laughs> Stay safe everybody! See you tomorrow for Sunday lunch. Woo! Be well!